This looks old. <laughs> This. Can I, I hold it? Well, it's glass. We're not gonna get it. It's really pretty though. I'm in like a pretty tray to serve treats on. Indiana sandwich pattern. A little milk glass bowl. And I don't use those anymore. Let's keep that. Keep that? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it costs, but that's cool. I don't know what it'd be used for either. It's pretty neat. These are pretty. Serve desserts in those. Four for 350, that's really pretty. Oh, and this is a fun decorative bowl. 850, this is pretty. No markings on the bottom. <laughs> lamp we don't really have a little lamp do we yeah. this is pretty I'm in the room. we do have a lamp in the living room yeah and sugar is set Ooh. it's really heavy you gotta be careful this one more crystal it's like a pickle. This would be for pickles. This is pretty. I think I'll get that because it is on sale. They're shaped like pineapple. And then this is like grapes. This is like an apple. <laughs> Be nice to give someone flowers in. These go over. What's the price? Waffle maker. Did you find a waffle maker?
right, so I'm gonna share my haul from my last two thrifting trips. So the first one I had my girls with me and we went to one of my favorite thrift stores where they have clearance items, like a white tag was 50% off and yellow was 75% off. So everything I got at that thrift store, I got on sale. And then my husband and I were on a date and we stopped at a, um, it was kind of an antique store with repurposed items as well. So I have a little bit of a spring haul plus some items I'll put in my antique booth. So first thing I found was this mold. It's got the copper um, feel to it. It doesn't have much for wear. It looks like they actually did use it though. And it was $1.50 yellow, so 75% off of $1.50 which is a really good price. So the total for these first few items I show you was like $6.50. So just a cute little uh, copper mold for jello cakes, things like that. And I'll put this in my antique booth because people are looking for these I've seen before. All right, you saw me look at this if you watched my shopping. This is a beautiful old plate. It has no markings on the back. So I'm not sure if it's ironstone or not. I'm assuming it might be. It just is really beautiful. This I will probably keep. It was $2.50, but 75% off of that. So very good price. I thought this would be fun to replace some of my plates I have hanging around or sitting around on a shelf for springtime with the florals, the pinks, the blues, the yellows. So that was a really good price for a very old, beautiful plate. All right, I got this jar on the bottom. It says Mexico, so I don't know if it actually is from Mexico. Um, it says half a liter, so it was two fifty white tag, so it was a dollar twenty five. This is great for florals in the spring, serving uh, water in when guests come. I like having these around for just purposes of different facets of life. Okay, then I did find this new sweater. I thought this would be good for transitioning into spring. I had another sweater, but it just started wearing poorly, and so I wanted to switch it out. I don't have any like tan cream colored sweaters. This is an Old Navy brand. Um, it's a large, I'm not usually large, but with being pregnant, definitely wearing larger sweaters. I'm not always wearing maternity clothes either, but it's just got some knit work to it. It's got some little slits on the side, on the bottom. Uh, I would definitely have to wear a tank top under it because it is a little bit see-through if I don't. So I thought that would be a nice sweater to have here for the rest of February into the cooler months. Wear it over a dress, it would look really great. So maybe I'll have to try that on for you to see. And this was, they took the tag off. So I think this was five, but I think it was yellow or white. One of the two, like I told you, I got all clearance. So either way, it was on sale. And then I got one little t-shirt for my almost two-year-old, the two t-shirt that she actually is wearing today. So I won't be showing you that. Okay, to the next store. You saw me look at the blue ball mason jar. I like to find these and re-put them in my antique booth. And I decorated my little cottage with some blue mason jars. If you haven't seen that video, that came out last week. And so, or the beginning of this week, honestly, this was $3.99, I want to say. It looks like they paid a dollar for it and they priced it up to four, but I can get these sold for about $8 or so in my booth. So blue mason jars are beautiful for spring with florals and good to resell. I got these two gold candlesticks. I'm always looking for gold candlesticks to put in my booth as well. They both were $6.99 together, and I have sold gold candlesticks for $8, $10 a piece. So if you're looking to resell things, look for some of these items. If you have a booth of your own, or if you list them on Marketplace, those are always good places to try to resell. But these are really pretty. They have some good detailing on there. They have some patina on some of the um, edges there. So just really pretty gold candlesticks. If I didn't have a few gold candlesticks myself already, I would probably keep these and they're very heavy duty and sturdy, but I will be reselling these. 
right, lastly, this bowl. I like using these in my home, so I will probably use this one for spring because it has the blue and the pink. It was, I think this one was $5.99 or $6.99. I can't remember what the tag said when I got it. Not on sale or anything, but it's got some chipping on the top, so it just would be cute to display some of my fruit on my kitchen counter. And then if I don't use it in the next several months, I can resell it always. But this will be a fun find to put out for spring decor. So that is my haul in my thrift with me. I hope you enjoy coming along and seeing the vintage pieces I found. And I'll be bringing you on more of these because I can tell you guys enjoy watching these. So that's something I'll try to do a couple times a month for you. And then, of course, I'll have to show you how I decorate my home with some of the pieces that I have found. And springtime is coming, so the spring decor will be coming out as well. All right, talk with you guys in the next one.